dog breeds, chihuahua. Hello and welcome to Video Jug. We're here at the Crufts Dog Show in Birmingham, England. Crufts is the largest dog show in the world and draws the finest pedigree dogs to its competitions. We spoke to dog owners and breeders to find out more about the different breeds of man's best friend. In this film, we meet Chihuahua Liberty Bell and her owner, Lorraine. Step one, personality. Chihuahua's personalities, they're full of fun, all up to all sorts of things, but they're, they're very friendly, outgoing little dogs and they have a reputation for being nasty and snappy, but I promise you they are not. They are just wonderful, wonderful little people. Step two, exercise. Well, all dogs need to be walked and chihuahuas are no different to any other dog. And I think it's good for them to go for walks, to meet other dogs, other people. But generally, in the world that we are today, if you are a busy household, a large garden will suffice. Step three, feeding. The, the diet is as you would any other dog, really. You, know, you don't need to get them too fat because they are prone to, go, to going to fat. You have to watch their diet because that relates to their mouth and their teeth. Uh, as long as they go for dental checks or their, their diet um, keeps the, the tartar from building up on their teeth. Step four, grooming. Two types of chihuahuas are long coat and smooth coat. This is a smooth coat, very, very little upkeep. Uh, I mean, she was bathed on Sunday to come here. I give them a bath generally about once every month or so just to keep them happy and comfortable and, and smelling nice, but the upkeep is minimal. Uh, the only other maintenance is nails. They do have to have their nails trimmed. You can either do it yourself if confident or go to the vet and they're quite happy to do it for you. Step five, breeding. But the breeding of chihuahuas, they're not easy because of their size. The bitches to be the ideal brood bitch really needs to be a little bit on the larger side. Um, but they're very, very prone to needing caesareans um, because they're so small and so narrow through their pelvis. 